Well, Charlotte is growing. The headaches over how to accommodate all those extra people in cars is, is getting tough. So we're kicking off a little segment we like to call What's driving you crazy? What is it? Road construction, changing school districts, whatever is making you frustrated, we want to know about it because we're going to talk about it. And Ruby is the one who's talking about <laughs> things that are making you crazy. Joining us right now to talk about um, these major issues because there are a lot of things happening and people it's making people full of rage. Yeah, so there are a lot of things happening out on the roads, but the first major issue is in Gaston County. Now, if you drive it, you know it. I-85, whether it's in the morning or after work, there's a lot of traffic. So we're going to talk to NCDOT about what they're doing to fix the issue. Let's face it, driving on I-85 is driving everyone crazy. Something that should take you only, you know, 30 minutes to get somewhere. It takes you an hour to two hours. So crazy, Martha Abernathy has spent the last two years looking for different routes. A lot of times I'll go down 485 and cut through the back roads to get home. But now a potential solution. So we're looking to add a lane in each direction. NCDOT is creating a $262 million plan to add extra lanes on I-85 from exit 17 in Gastonia to exit 27 in Mount Holly. We'll go from three to four lanes in each direction uh, for a 10 mile segment. Crews will also relocate or replace bridges, overpasses, and upgrade interchanges. Maybe also building some auxiliary lanes between exits, which would just be like a continuous flow from one exit to another and not interrupting flow in the other lanes. The goal? To reduce congestion and improve the traffic flow in Gastonia to other cities. But don't expect to see orange cones and barricades just yet. Construction is not set to start until 2021. I think it'll be worse for a while. I mean, maybe in the long run it might help a little. But... All right, this is just one of many issues out on the road, so we want to hear from you. What is driving you crazy? Tweet oh, us using crazy. hashtag Wake Up Charlotte or message us on social media. So, Ben and Carolyn, you have to have something that's driving you crazy when you're out on the road. There was a time last week where trying to get north of Uptown, south of Uptown was nearly impossible because John Belk had, mm -hmm. was down to one lane, 77 was down to maybe two lanes, and then Grand Street Uptown. Ah, that is driving <laughs> me crazy. There's no way to get through at all. Yeah, so it could be road construction, pop holes it could be anything just yeah. tweet us write us on social media anything and we want to know what is driving you crazy are we driving you crazy Maybe. perhaps <laughs> tweet wake up clt